I am so big. Let me show you my stomach. Oh, yes. I keep looking at my jeans every day, like drooling. I'm just being like, God, I can't wait. Here's how I feel real, real candidly about the baby. I'm very excited about the baby. I'm ready for the baby to come. But then there's a huge part of me that's like, holy f you're about to have two, like having two children that are with you for the rest of your lives that you're responsible for, that you need to make sure are completely well-adjusted, nice, not f up. I mean, forget it. How am I supposed to do that? Happy New Year! Oh my God, what did you guys all do for New Year's? Do you know what I did for New Year's? Are you gonna ask? I dinner at home because I was actually gonna go to dinner with myself, my husband, my girlfriend, and her husband in a private room. It was gonna be extra COVID safe, like have no contact, have one waiter masked, and that waiter ended up having COVID, so we canceled. So I basically put on a, a Prada dress, okay, sparkles, you saw, and um, I wore it for about two hours, had dinner, and then I put on sweats and went to bed at around 10.45. So that was my New Year's. You might have noticed that I am back at home because with COVID as of late, I have decided to be extra responsible and just keep myself and baby extra, 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 extra safe. Okay, so let's talk about New Year's. Let's talk about the year 2022. Let's talk about my New Year's resolutions. I've actually really been thinking about my New Year's resolutions. First of all, I'm not big on resolutions because I do feel like there's so much hype. You put so much pressure on yourself and then all of a sudden you're like, okay, it's March and I'm like back to having like nine Cokes a day. But I think my overall state of being is what I'm going to work on in terms of my New Year's resolution, which is just, I'm going to just care a little bit less. I'm just gonna carpe diem, I'm just gonna seize the moment. Overall, I'm just going to relax in general. My psychic told me two weeks ago that this is my life and I can settle into it and I don't need to be nervous about it. What Jordan? would Jordan say your resolution should be? Let's call him and ask him what my New Year's resolution should be. Hello. Oh, hi. Hi, Ro. You're on speakerphone on Necessary Realness. We just wanted to know quickly, what do you think my New Year's resolution should be? Uh, I, w I would go with complain less. This year, I really tried to make an effort to not complain as much. That has not gone well. Okay. Complain less is one. And then do you have another one? Um, keep being so sweet. Am I this? I'm like toffee sweet, huh? Like hard to chew, but once you get through it, very sweet. Yep. Okay. That was good. Thank you. We'll call you later. I think that's an accurate description of who I am as a human being. I'm extremely sweet, but there is definitely a barrier there. You know, I don't know what my resolutions for Jordan would be. He's like so like adjusted and nice. He like is a productive human being. I mean that honestly. He's a great cook. He's regimented. He works out every day. He drinks a lot of water. He doesn't drink too much alcohol. He's a really good dad. It's annoying. You know what? I don't know. I have to get back. Ask me in 2023 and I'll tell you when we have two kids and really real. Let us know what you guys think in the comments below. And if you missed last week's episode, don't forget to check that out. And don't forget to subscribe for more Necessary Realness.